To another vlog. It is, I feel like I had to say the day, it's Tuesday the 9th of November, it's 2 p.m. and you'll have just seen me doing a client's nails. I kind of started off the vlog straight away doing a client's nails because I was literally doing her nails. It's my friend and client Beth. They turned out so cool. I'm literally obsessed with how they turned out. I'm obsessed, like rainbow, opal. I've done similar things before. I kind of like mushed a couple of designs together. We really love how they turned out. So yeah, just finished doing her nails. I literally still haven't cleaned up from doing her nails. I've still got like the palette and stuff here. And I need to clean down the desk and like this from where I was dabbing off the sponge. So for the rest of the day, I've got to go to Nails Lux HQ, package a few orders. So I might take you along with me there, maybe. And I need to go to the post office to post all the orders. I'm really excited tonight for Nails Lux. We've got, for the month of November, we've actually got loads of nail art, free nail art live workshops over on the Nails Lux Instagram account. I've got eight guest artists coming on, nail artists, and they're doing like a nail art workshop on there. And it's been really cool. I've had two so far and got one tonight so I've got to prep for that tonight and we are saving all of the live nail art workshops on the account if you do want to see them and you can't watch them live that's cool you can, you can go watch them on the nails lux I'll pop a little pop up here that's the account go follow that they're on there because I've got two clients I haven't done their nails 
for such a long time because one of them was training to be a doctor, the other one moved away and I'm going to be starting to do their nails again as of this week so I'm really excited about that. So yeah, I'll film some of that for you guys as well. Also, I'm going to start not only the vlog today but also this part two of the Declutter series. If you haven't caught my Declutter... <laughs> If you haven't caught my Declutter series yet, episode one is already up on the channel. It was a few months ago now, but basically I went through these drawers here and I decluttered loads of gel polishes and all that good stuff. I'm gonna move on to these guys and then I've also got these drawers in here that I need to do. So yeah, I wanna get to cluttering, especially these guys. So I think I might start the part two declutter and going through all of my nail art stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna start filming that today. So I might add some little sneak peeks in here because I think this vlog will go up before the declutter, yeah? So I'm not sure. If it's up already, I'll leave it linked in the description box down below, but if it's not, it's coming soon. So yeah. Oh, this is really cool. I just thought I'd share it with you guys. I've just moved it out of the way. But Ikea, if you've got that lamp from Ikea that everyone has, Ikea's got some new colours. So I got, I picked up a new colour. It's this gorgeous, like, taupey, greyy, beigey colour. It looks so much nicer in the salon rather than, you can actually see the base of the other one there. It was like a dark grey. I much prefer this. And it's like, shiny so you don't see like the dust on it or fingerprints when i'm trying to take photos of clients nails and it gets a little bit oily so yeah i'm just going to quickly give this desk a little tidy up clean sanitize everything get it all clean and clean and clean right okay enough talking let's get cracking i do need to have a massive source out of the salon because as per usual as i always say it's in such a mess so yeah let's get cracking let's get cleaning and I'll catch you throughout the day. These are all my dirty tools and EFAR bits. So just going to leave them there. I'm gonna sort them out later. In fact, I'm just gonna pop this to the side. always do this leave gel polish on it for days and then it goes all really like thick and tarry and ugh, really hard to remove I just like to make things really difficult for myself okay so what i've actually decided to do is completely clear off the desk literally get my lamps off get everything clear and clean and i'm going to start doing the declutter I'm just gonna dive right in. I've been avoiding it for months because I know I'm gonna wanna hoard everything and keep everything because I am a hoarder and I can't let go of nail stuff. But I'm just gonna wipe down the table and then take every single drawer out and just lay it out on the table. I don't even think they're all gonna fit to be honest. But, but I'm gonna give it a go and yeah, start the huge Jakarta of those drawers. It's gonna be a mission and my goal, ideally, at a minimum, is to clear out at least one of these drawers. So that's three separate drawers and one compartment. So that's at a minimum, so that's the goal, guys. Wish me luck. I'm gonna start recording, yeah, that video. So yeah, I'll insert a couple of clips of the Takata in this vlog as well as like a little sneak peek. But yeah, I need to get cracking. HQ now, a little bit of time has gone by, but I've literally just arrived and I'm just packaging some orders. So I thought I'd uh, package an order with you guys. So this one is to Ryan. These are the little bracelet cards that we put in to say who the order's packed by and for everyone receiving their order. And then yeah, we've got brush I, G, F, E, D and C. So I've grabbed them all out. So I just need to go through and check I've got them all. 
I just like to make sure and go through. Lovely. And then we can package. A little spray of our Top Secret Nails Lark Signature Scent Formula. And then we just apply the little postage label on top and pop it in one of our recyclable bags to protect it in this lovely winter weather. But yeah, got a few more orders to do. So I'm going to package them and get them done and dusted. I'd show you guys some of the behind the scenes of prepping for the next restock so we're prepping loads of boxes getting them folded and ready there is literally stacks and stacks and stacks ready to go little boxes and big boxes ready for the next restock and then we have got brushes in these guys over here so they're currently being restocked at the moment so some of these are completely out and completely empty but we're working we're working on it so brush a is nice and full again and so is brush b and then we're gonna continue working through and getting them all ready to go and then yeah still got to package a few more orders up but yeah there's some more boxes in here that are all stacked up ready to go for the next restock which will be the last friday in november so black friday so yes prep for the next restock is well underway the next restock is the last friday in november that will be the last restock of this year guys so if this vlog goes up before the restock you guys have a little sneak sneak knowing you guys know first um i'll leave the link to nails lux's website in the description box down below but hi guys I think I'm going to sign off from tonight's vlog and I'll pick the camera back up tomorrow or Thursday when I've got some clients. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow or Thursday or whenever I pick the camera back up. See ya! So guys, little sneak peek into the declutter part two. Oh my gosh, it's currently quarter. No, I can't tell the time. 10 to 11 at night. It's the next day now. It's actually Wednesday the 10th of November. I thought I'd just pop on the vlog and just come and show you my progress. Beatrice is joining me in the salon, aren't you, baby? Hi. So, yeah, this is the progress so far. This is everything I've decluttered. I think I've done really well so far. I mean, it goes deep as well. It goes right down there. There's loads of bits and bobs in there, but yeah. That's everything I've decluttered so far. I've cleared out four of these tray things that go in here. So I'm doing well. My goal was to clear out three and I've done four and I filled this up. And there's still definitely more to go and I can declutter more. So I'm gonna, gonna give it a go. I'm gonna see if I can maybe get rid of a few of these gels that I don't really use. So guys, I've managed to declutter a lot more. I'm obviously showing you in depth, in full, what I'm decluttering and everything in the whole dedicated declutter for all my nail art stuff. I want to declutter these guys here, which are the water decals and also my sticker and decal book in here because it's literally overflowing. But 
it's now 20 past 12 and I would like to go to bed. So much harder than I thought it was going to be. I de have definitely done better than I thought I would do. And I definitely need to not look in this box. Otherwise, I'm going to start picking things out and wanting to keep them. I'm proud of what I've decluttered so far. And then once I've finished decluttering all the nail art stuff, I need to go back through this and put it into sections of what I will be selling, what is going to go into the giveaway, what is going to go to my friend, and all that kind of thing. So, yeah, that needs sorting out as well. But I'm just going to these drawers away now because they can go in.